Cardinal's not in his room. Good. Uh, I bet he went back to stuffing himself. That's fine, though. Why did he go somewhere when he could just stuff himself right here with this cake? Also, his room is smaller than mine. No, it isn't. There is a doorway. I was like, ha ha! Ha ha, mine's twice this size. But no. So, I don't think we've been in this room at all. Which is great, because I urgently need bits of bobs. Um, this is his little prayer area, I guess. That's his bebele. My dear Giuseppe, poor health forbids me from joining you. Please thank Sir Gregory for his invitation to Lord Mortimer's. I'm convinced you'll be able to strengthen our agreements. Please tell Sir Gregory that his enterprise concerning our friend Cardinal Bishop Chiaramonti is following its course. Hmm. I place my trust in you. May God bless you and give you protection. S.S. Giovanni Angelico Braschi. Braschi. Prego. All right, okay. That's fine. Um, I'll pop outside in a moment. There could be things in there. On the balcony to explore. It's a bit annoying he's not here, but if he's gone to stuff himself, which is what we've said, he's probably... All right, mate. Uh, he's... <laughs> Oh my god, the tiny... I just saw the tiny penis as well. Um, he's probably in the dining room. Uh, it was just... I mainly I mainly wasn't looking at the dick. I was looking at the face. Look at his face. He's like... Hey. Oh no. No thanks. Oh, hello. This is Thursday. This is Thursday. Oh good. Amber. More collectible coins I ain't using. Uh, amber fragments. If we get four, you get one more um, triangle. Just get more action points. There's a lot of royal jelly here, which is good because I need um, I need more action points. That's that you kind of have this purge of action points, and then you're like, shit, I need more. Where am I gonna get them from? Oh, Let's hello. Have a look at his personal papers. Of Cause, course, cause it's so? in Latin, the language of the church. Da, 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 domine. Oh fuck, really? You can't afford it. <sighs> Thank you, mother, for teaching me this. Hang on. Da, 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 All of those da, da. hours of learning Latin declensions are going to pay off in the end. Mother will be proud. Now this could be interesting. Let's say a sync tape. Yes. Various representation criteria, of which are shown the most common throughout the centuries, and in different forms. If Piaggi's notes are anything to go by, the weapon I'm looking for is shaped like a tapered spear. Spear! Well, that should help me identify it. Not leaf. That is, there's only one of those. There is only one spear that is spear shaped with copper and a fish. Easy boys, we've done it. Who needs Piaget? Although we should probably try and find Piaget. That almost scared me, that plant. So you're very welcome for the advent, homicidal bacon. I, I enjoy advent. It is, I, I'm sure I'm gonna be just going uh -huh, by the end of it, but it is a lot of fun. There's been some right clangers so far. Don't look that Fuck it out. Great. Uh, no. No, we're not taking it. You can just look at some in here. I think I've taken all there is to take. Just going and looking at bookage. Wow. This is definitely the red room. Yeah! Here it is. Um, I can't see Piaget. Oh! Oh, shit. Well, that's a bit grim. One moment, Piaget. Let me just check there isn't anything I can loot first. Well, there is. Brilliant. Devil's Thorn. Um, let's just go to the other side of the room. Look at all these foods. This is one thing that the council does quite well, is food. Like, fine details. It's a weird art style. It is slightly dishonoured-y. It's also quite a sharp... Um, Sharp art style. But I do quite like it. Oh, hang on. There's one more over here. Oh, 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 look. We've got it all back. Almost all back. That's perfect. That means we can actually do some shit. Check some stuff out. Also, really? That's a bit dangerous, isn't it? I mean... <laughs> 
fucking giant moon door, but yes. Alright, go on Elixir. Nice. I think I've gotten everything off the table and off the floor. So, yeah, let's have a chat with... Oh, God, let's have a chat with Piaget. Hello? Can you imagine if you just make him go, whoop, and he falls off? Your eminence, would you have a moment to spare? Not now, Louis. Please, leave me alone. Oh. I beg your pardon? I want to be alone. Very well. I, I'm only searching for information about the lance of Longinus, the soldier. If you, you could... not listening to me. You are playing with fire. I heard you speak to Mr. Von Volner about it, and I was wondering if you could tell me something about it. That was a private conversation. How could I have known that he was listening to us? Hmm. I see what you mean. Louis, don't push it. Why isn't he facing us? Still can. Your Eminence, are you all right? Mm -mm. Your Eminence, are you with me? Can you turn around, please? What do you want to know about the Holy Lands, Louis? Your Eminence, turn around. This is the weapon used by a Roman centurion on the very day Christ was nailed to the cross. Look at me. Longinus thrust his lance in the right side of Jesus. That's not the Please. same guy he was talking to As us a second wish. ago. You alright, buddy? What the fuck's going on? <laughs> you tripping balls? His nose is bleeding. Possession. So you are looking for the holy lance of Longinus. Don't, don't, don't talk to him. Do not talk to him. He is bad egg. Bad egg. Bad, bad egg. Um. Five. Can I afford that? Uh. Oh shit, I don't know. Your eminence, you're worrying me. What is happening to you? Nothing. Just a moment of weakness. But I'm better now. That's not what it sounded I am like. All ears. You are looking for the lance. You should know you are not the only one. Lord Mortimer has spent a good part of his life and his fortune trying to find it. Never will he let you have it. But tell me, before going any further, have you spoken to anyone else about this? Uh, immunity means that stuff's gonna happen. If I'm not careful. Uh, shit. Uh, I, uh, uh, no. No, you are the first I've spoken to about it, Your Eminence. That's Come a lie. now, Louis. Are you quite sure of that? Ah! No, I'm not. Yes. My mother, Volna. Oh, fuck. I should tell, I should say. Oh, this is difficult. I'm just, I could blame it on Volna. The problem I have is, I'm very, like, he, there was a, I don't know. It was like one of those scenes, wasn't it? Where it's like, why aren't you turning around? And he's like, oh, I'm fine, hello. It's like, mm. Um. Oh, shit. I mean, we know that, we know that Wal Volna and Piaggi work together, so maybe we'll do that. If I say my mother, she's been missing, so that would imply that I've talked to her since she's gone missing. Which we kind of don't want anyone to know. Well, I spoke to Mr. Von Volner about it. Why? Because you are endangering all those who know anything about this lance, Louis. Anyone else? That's all. No one else. What are you going to use the lance for, exactly? Fishing. Um, to protect myself. I guess to protect myself. Uh, yeah, yeah, I just want to be doubly sure. I need it. Why? You won't understand. <sighs> Try me, Louis. I need to protect myself with it. Yes! Louis, I thank you for your sincerity. That's not... I shall answer you about Longinus. You deserve to be told. I lied so much. headed lance did indeed pierce the side of the Messiah. His blood gushed out, covering the head of the lance. It was covered in the blood of Christ. Completely Thank covered. Thank you, Your Eminence. You are welcome. Be careful, Louis. You are on a perilous path. Thanks. Don't follow Sarah's demons, my boy. Don't delve too deeply into her delusions, mm. or you won't be able to come back. The demons that she is frantically trying to drive away are in her own mind. Take good care of yourself. God keep you. 
See, this brings up an interesting, another interesting conversation about this game is... Um, is... Is it supernatural or is it mental health? We've already had a girl who claimed to be possessed that you could have read as epilepsy or schizophrenia. So... That's playing off of that, like, is our mum actually imagining demons? Or are there legit demons? Or are there both? Who knows? Um, so I... Mm, mm. Um, I don't... Oh, Piaggi, Piaggi told me it's the shape of a boar spear. Well, actually, he didn't say anything about boar, but that basically narrows it down, and I'm pretty sure it is that, that one. The ex-Genesis mentions a shiny metal. It does, but Volna told us that that was uh, due to upselling. Adam, thank you very much for the 14 months in a row. So we're going to go back to the maze, and I'm just going to go for that one. Because I don't... There's not that much choice otherwise, unless it's none of them. And the damn thing is... Oh! Lying to us. Which is possible. So, read process of elimination as we don't have any other fucking option. It's got to be this spear. Which worries me, because it's too obvious. But it's the only one that is copper and iron, has a fish on it, and is in the shape of a spear. It did say completely covered in blood, which that one isn't. But uh, maybe it was clean. You know? Must be sure of my choice. I cannot get it wrong. Fuck I'm off! Absolutely sure this is the one to take. No, but I don't have an option. I, I literally, I don't have a fucking option. Holy shit! Is there some blood on it? I guess they're probably. I mean, to be fair, they're all spears. There's gonna be some blood on it as far as you go. Also, can there? Thank you for the eight months. Fuck it. I mean, I've already chopped off my fucking arm. Oh, hello. I bet they I bet they all call themselves the Lance of Longinus. It supposedly makes it possible to kill demons. Also, demons is spelt as in Philip Pullman demons there. Not demons as in the rest of the time. I, we'll find out. I mean, you know, we'll just find a demon and stab it. That'll do the job. Join our mother at the wharf. Mother? Right, we've got to go to the wharf. I look forward to discovering it's a shitty little, like, 99p store equivalent. Also, yes, we are doing Advent. As Badger has said in the chat, Hannah's Advent is on. Uh, it's on a new channel, which is um, not gaming related. It's more vlogging related, so it kind of works a bit better. Um, just on, like, everything. It's, I, it's confusing. It's like trying to put... If you had, like, a row of books in the horror category and you started putting politics in there, it really fucks with the search engine. So it was advised, if we do it, to try doing it on a different channel. Um, I look forward to Article 13 just exploding everything, though. Just, pff, that's the end of that. But we're trying to, we're going to try off the back of Advent to do, like, two videos a week. Loads of cool things. So, like, I say loads of cool things. Loads of shit things. For example, I bought a build a gingerbread house kit. So we might vlog that. Which is just going to be me trying to bake this bloody bread gingerbread and then try and assemble it by punching it or oh, I just eat it <coughs> loads of stuff I've got some fun ideas it's going to be fine I'll watch it oh, oh. I've not found all the clues enabling me I did not find all the copies what what do you mean I didn't find any but it says I've chosen it success so did I get it right I must have gotten it right what slightly annoys me is uh, we oh fuck I don't care I don't care that much I suppose we could have gone and looked at a load of paintings there were paintings in Mortimer's office actually so and I, there was like a I, I seem to recall there was also not only there was like excerpts of stuff as well so we could have looked at all of that but I just couldn't be asked I thought I might get caught again so annoyingly, I have failed 
even though I appear to have found it. Yes, there is a statue, isn't there? Up in his like area, there's like a, a yeah, there's a load of things. He's really into the he's really into the lance. I mean, it would make sense if it's a mythical thing that's supposed to kill people and it also stabbed Jesus in the side, but I mean, who knows? Level up. Yes. Now, I don't really get these figures. I'm pretty sure they're fucked because I haven't completed 3,103 objectives, but whatever, mate. Right, it's points time. Okay, so I need to choose where I'm going to level up. Currently, I am quite an occultist spec, but that's fine. Yes, the Spear of Destiny badger. Yes, Hitler was obsessed with it. Um, he should have looked on this island because apparently I've got it. Along with every single one in history. Um, hang on. So I have four points. I could skill up this. Four points. I think it would be stupid to not do that. And then... Well, I've got two left. So it would be two more points in that to leave... Two more points in that. Two more points in that. I think linguistics is probably going to help us more. Although agility can kind of be handy. Maybe I should start specking into agility. Ooh, I don't know. You always... Like, currently, we could have used some agility to push open Mortimer's casket. But we've also been needing to translate quite a bit. Oh, this is difficult. What do we reckon, chat? Or you could politics. I would say politics is one of the least important. But linguistics we've had a lot of issues with. Agility, not so much. But when we need it, it seems to be quite intense. We can't, like, get another point anyway. So... Or, or, what about a full point in linguistics instead? That might be a better option. Level two in linguistics. And then conviction. We can just brute force it later. I think that's a better call, actually. Chat's not fast. So, chat, you just, uh, just deal with it, chat. You snooze, you lose. <coughs> It's just going to be someone who's like, no, no, you've done it wrong. Thanks, Taryn. 19 months. I'm already Lord. pressed for time as it is. Mother's waiting for me on the wharf. Also, Bresso, thank you for your sub. Whilst I was going, ugh. Oh, what? This is bullshit. So many points off of it. I can only equip one manuscript. I'm missing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, that must be for the end of the whole thing. So. Oh, sorry, chat was busy with Hitler. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Just chat going off on the tangent about Spears and Hitler. Excellent. Um, okay, right. Bugger it. I, yeah, I'm annoyed I haven't got more manuscripts, but I haven't seen any to steal. I probably missed them, like the, the Jacques Peru one I've missed. But we shall see. Hello? Mother at the waff. Hang on. The waff. The waff a thin waff. Alright. So going through here. We go down here. Going in here. Go to the waff. Where is the waff? Oh, hang on. Let's go in. And then we'll Duh! Sticking your nose everywhere Jesus wow. wept! Napoleon! Excuse me, monsieur. I don't follow you. I haven't come all this way just to fail so close to the goal. Why? What are you talking about? I am talking about what you are doing. This conference is going to boost my career. There is no question of me letting you ruin everything. I just surprised Piaget and Volner talking. You are about to rob Mortimer. Sorry? Give me what you took from him immediately. Let's keep calm, please. I, I don't know what you're talking about. I'll have to cut this short quick. Uh... Fuck it. Go! Do it! Do it! Do it! Oh my god! He went down so easily there.
So uh, Napoleon was a bit of a twat, and I just sort of gave him a little slap, and that dealt with him. <laughs> oh, fuck. How do I leave? I think I leave that. Oh, shit. Hang on. So I'm going to have to go. You have to go all the way around. All right. That's fine. That's fine. I just as long as I go this a consistent way round. I like how Napoleon didn't have a comeback to that. He just sort of went, what? You did what? You hit the Napoleon? How dare you? Probably was a bad idea. Oh, shit, in the long run. Oh, fuck. I can't go that way. Oh, this is bad. Um. Oh, that's why. Because actually... It's upstairs? Oh shit, I can't go that way either. Oh, this is bad. It's a good thing I didn't lose my slapping hand. I know. My. Uh, to be fair, if I'd punched him with my stub, it might have done more damage. <laughs> Just. <ugh. laughs> oh, dude. Right, hang on. Let's try going this way. I don't like that it's kind of shut. Like that that implies that we ain't getting we ain't getting actually to the front door. Cause it's funneling us away. <laughs> Just shit talking the French now in chat. <laughs> God damn. I mean, he was a quite a small man, to be fair. Lou is quite a tall boy, I think. I don't know. Oh, shit! Hello. It's Godoy. Am I disturbing you? Monsieur it de Richet, it seems you are everywhere. At least he hasn't noticed my arm. Was Mr. Von Volner able to help you? Um, help me? Yes. For your armillary sphere. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, that. Louis! Everything all right? Yeah, mate. I, yes, yes. <laughs> Excuse me, I, I was miles away. Oh, <laughs> while you're here, you wouldn't know who the last guest is, would you? What, what do you mean? I heard Sir Gregory speaking about it. A is certain Al-Asif something or other. Oh, oh. What? obviously I, 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 not. I, I, no. It's not important. Forget it. No, 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 no. Hang on. It doesn't matter, I'm telling you. We'll find out soon enough. I'm in a hurry right now. I, I'm waiting for someone. Who? See you later, Louis. What? Shit. I haven't time either. See you later. Bye, Pish. Well, that's a bit interesting. Also a bit blundery. Who you ever heard of the Necronomicon before? It might be a guest. Fuck's sake. Yes, Badger, you want another cup of tea? Oh, no, it's a cutscene. I knew we were being funneled. Who's here? Or am I just trying to leave now? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ah, Louis. Shit. Perfect timing. As luck would have it. Come, my boy. I would like to have a word with you. I don't have a spear in my pocket. Um. I can't leave. I'm going to have to blag it. Nobody panic. This is Get the head. Closer, please. The head honcho it's himself. It's time we had a little chat. I wanted you. Oh, no. Your hand. Damn it. No. So that's it. She's prepared to use you. What do you mean? wasn't enough for her to lose her hand. She had to make you lose yours, too. I cannot permit this to continue. Louis, it's time you found out the truth. Uh -oh. I've been observing you since you arrived. I see you running all over the grounds in the search of Sarah. I would like to prevent her from leading you even further down the wrong road. Uh, that? You see, Sarah and I have known each other for a very long time, Louis. I am aware of her theory. About me? Demon. About Gregory? Demon. About the demons? Uh. She's right. What? Look at me. I have inhabited this body since 1191. For the last 602 years, I have been this dear William Mortimer. Um, okay. Also, thanks, Aquaria, for the bits. Um, so what? You literally just went into that. Lucifer. 
the fallen archangel, left heaven accompanied by 133,306,668 angels. What? Is it true that there are that many of you? No, I assure you, Louis. Forget your Bible class. It's ridiculous. We are not angels. We don't have wings. There is certainly nowhere near a million of us. And for that matter, no sacred human text represents us correctly. Uh. There are several families. And the family to which I belong has eight siblings, including Gregory and myself. Sir Gregory is your brother? Yes, what can I say? <laughs> you can't choose your family. But it is very <laughs> difficult to know exactly how many of us there are because a large number of our kind remain hidden or never reveal themselves even to us. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, do they manipulate thoughts? And you truly have the power to manipulate the thoughts of men. That's right. Every demon has the capacity to infiltrate the minds of men and to read and steer their thoughts. Oh, good. Well, that's comforting, isn't it? I look forward to... Uh, fuck knows. And what do you do with this power? We help them, of course. Ah! <laughs> Almost. And how is it you help men, exactly? Let's just say that without us, man would probably never have left his cave. Fire, the wheel, tools, writing... We are the spark that inspires man to search, to grow, to evolve. Right. Can you tell me more about your capacities, your supernatural powers? Supernatural? From my point of view, they are perfectly natural. Well, Louis, just because the monkey does not fly doesn't mean that we should consider the bird a supernatural creature. We are all part of a grand design. We are simply made like this. By developing our art, we are able to read thoughts as well as write in the minds of men. It is possible for us to make them bow to our desire, but it doesn't work without leaving some scars. Right. Okay. So people who are mentally fucked up in this game might have been forced, is that what you're saying? Like, what's a face who, who commits suicide in episode one? because she's possessed. And again, it's the possession than the epilepsy story. This game likes to float between, like, is it, is it a mental health thing or is it a supernatural thing? But now we have the actual supernatural. I mean, we did have that before because we were starting to see weird visions. So it could be a mishmash of both anyway. But what I am not sure about is how we fit in because we can have these visions does our mum have these visions? We part demon. Did Mumsy bonk a demon? Uh, okay, here we go. Why tell me all this? But why me? Why do I tell you about the greatest secret ever revealed to man? It's... that's right. I'm coming to that. Don't worry. Why right. should I trust you? I'm not asking you to, Louis. If you are still in doubt about the demons, I can assure you that won't last long. Well, good! Brilliant! Thanks so much! What are the demons' projects for humanity? Our aim has long since been to protect humanity from itself. On the other hand, although we give them the impulse to succeed, we don't all agree as to the path they take to achieve it. Brilliant. Okay. Um... What exactly is a demon? No, what's happening with my mother? What has my mother got to do with all this? She embarked on a crusade many years ago to kill all the demons. That must have upset you. I imagine you retaliated. No, I'm afraid she never forgave me. Forgave uh, what? We met when she was still just a young woman. I appeared to her in a different form because I didn't want to reveal the identity of Lord Mortimer at that time. Oh, she bitch. was looking for someone interested in the occult to decipher an ancient book. Oh, we spent bitch. many years together until I revealed my true nature to her. Oh god, is Mortimer... Oh no, buddy. I think our dad might be Mortimer and we're half demon. What happened next? She felt betrayed, manipulated, tricked. We had an argument. 
She rejected me, and then she simply disappeared. Just after that, she joined the Order and began to relentlessly hunt us down. Okay. I mean, that's not particularly helpful, is it? I, I just, uh, I'm not going to call him the devil. Because if there's apparently however many million, it's very specific. Uh, pass. Continue. Louis, it's time you opened your eyes. Come, you'll soon see. Come. After you. Come with me. Uh, oh. Um, why a conference instead of imposing your will upon us? If you could manipulate us mentally, what's the point of all the theatrics of the conference? You must suspect that we asked ourselves that very same question. For many centuries, we didn't organize any conferences, and most of the time, it ended in civil war between demons. Many of us were killed during this period. Right. The idea of organizing conferences was the answer to everything. The interest being to erect some rules among ourselves. Our family first divided up all the principal countries of the world. Now, whenever one of us wants to propose a major change between these countries, right. they summon the demon in question, and initiate a conference. The demon that initiates the proposition doesn't have to give notification of the subject of the conference beforehand. Consequently, we participate along with our best assets. Once the humans are brought together, the conference begins, but we are forbidden to use our talents to influence the participants. The first meeting is held in order to expose the subject to all the participants, right. followed by several days of reflection during which we are allowed to be persuasive, but not to impose our will. Hang on a second minute. meeting closes the conference with a final vote. So, for you it's a game, isn't it? I understand your remark, but yeah. after living several centuries, you stand back and enjoy what reflection and pleasure you can. Uh, but it's almost like I'm the fucking subject you're talking about, and everyone's talking at me. It's almost like he's literally describing what's going down. If there's a second fucking meeting, they can go away. Um, do I care much about global policy? I suppose I kind of do. Boss. But how do you agree on global policy? Locally, we often have competing interests. And sometimes we start wars between men which are linked to our disagreements. Right, Most okay. of the time, our father steps in and gives directives. Father. Which my family follow Sorry? to the letter. Sorry, Indeed, father. In my opinion, it is high time we moved on. What do you mean? I mean that a new era must begin. What? The old monarchic regimes are outdated, and it's time to evolve. Okay, uh, but what about daddy? Did what happened to Elizabeth Adams have anything to do with you? Mm, unfortunately, the poor girl became an issue between us, in spite of herself. A family of demons is still a family, and as in all families, there are disputes. Elizabeth's family, the Adams, has always been under the patriarchal control of my father. As he and myself are not really on very good terms, Oh. Sending poor Elizabeth here was terribly rude of him, really. You oh, I did see. Accept, mm, no, I would say rather I was presented with a fait accompli by Gregory and went along with the intention of helping her. But this is my castle, and everyone is the master of their own home. Oh, I see. You're the one who killed her. The poor girl was oh. condemned, Louis. Oh. Don't you think it better that she stopped living like a slave? Being mentally raped by my father since the day she was born. Fucking hell. All right. That went very quick, very fast. So that was, um, that's the twin. That's Elizabeth's twin, Emma. Or did we shoot Emma? Whoever the fuck died. Just, oh God. I don't know. I don't know. I just, I, uh, you're not wrong. I mean, I've got a side with this dude. I've got to try and smuggle this spear out. But that's just suddenly jumped very quickly to that. Maybe you're right. Oh, no, crazy girl for the start. Oh, 
So he killed... Oh, no, he did kill her. So that was the one who dosed us. Who had the tattoos. Who thought she was possessed. And the messed up room. Uh, Von Borchert. Uh, so, all right. Von Borchert, he was looking for the Alazif for you. Exactly. Alazif has always belonged to my family, Louis. And with good reason. My father wrote much of it. Oh. Can you tell me what you've done with... What? You mean the Alazif? No, I, I already know that. Oh. Sarah came here with it and got rid of it. I was thinking of Von Borchert. He isn't essential, but... He is a trusted person. He's a prisoner at our headquarters in Paris. Oh, All right. yeah. From the very start of the game, of course. Of course. I, I love how he's just gone, oh yeah, my daddy wrote most of the fucking Necronomicon. Just throw that out there, along with my daddy being, like, top dollar. I oh, hope fuck. I've answered all your questions, Louis. Not really. I want to. I have something to show you. I want to know who your dad is. Is he Saturn? There, there is one question that remains to be answered. Why me? Why tell me all of this? Oh, haven't you guessed yet? He wants to retrieve the spear, I think. Let's uh just check this. Ha ha ha! I thought there would be one. He wants he wants the spear off of me. He doesn't need the support of the order. I can see where he's going with this. My lord, I don't know if I can answer in all honesty. Please do, Louis. You can say anything to me. Believe me. You must admit, being surrounded by all these servants isn't doing much to relax me. Oh, forget the servants. They're only here to ensure my safety. Why? What are you afraid of? Well, I wouldn't want you to get the wrong idea, Louis. But you have spent your entire life fighting the occult. You have just stolen the Holy Lance from me. What? And I do happen to be a demon. Do you not realize the power that relic has on a demon? No, I know it's power. Oh god, I don't really know what I could do at this point. I could blag it and just be like, Oh, I had no idea, but then he's going to want it back. You mean to tell me the lance can kill a demon? The lance is marked with my father's blood. What? It has acquired the capacity to block us inside our host. If a demon got injured by the holy lance, they wouldn't be able Lord. to change bodies. If the wound were mortal, the demon would surely die. Sorry, wait, wait, can, we, wait, can we go back to the bit minute. where... Did you just say that yeah. Jesus Christ was your father? That's right. It corresponds to one of the periods when my father had a dire need to show himself to men. Mm. But Daddy you also wrote the Necronomicon. So you're telling me that all of Christendom has been built on the myth of a demon? Boo! <laughs> Don't you think? But it is essential that men remain oblivious to that fact, Louis. All right. I'll let you imagine the cataclysm that would erupt and tear through all of the religions if ever they found out the truth. Look, well, we yeah. are of the gods, Louis. Always have been. You, as much as me. You are one of us, Louis. You, too, are a demon. Called it. Are you serious? You know it. Deep down inside, you know I am telling you the truth. Where do you think that natural charismatic presence comes from? Your talent must already have manifested <laughs> itself somehow. Okay. Have you ever had any visions? No. Stop it. It's absurd. Have you never found yourself suddenly inside someone else's body without knowing why? No. Whilst asleep, maybe? That's yes. how it often happens the first time. Your spirit wanders unconsciously. My mother can't have lied to me about that. It's true. Your real mother would never have lied I, to you. Sorry? I, what do you mean? Louis, I would rather you found this out from her own lips, but it's important that you know, Sarah is not your mother. I, what? what? Sorry you had to find out this okay. way, Louis. But you must know the truth before you commit an irreparable act. No, I, no, it, no, it's not possible. You are my son. Oh, what a surprise. Fire! Sorry? Oh god, is that Peru? Peru, calm down, Peru. Well, well. So now you're his bastard. You really took me for a fool. Peru. Don't make a move, you clowns. Everybody keep calm. Don't say a word or I'll shoot your kid. Wow. Uh, not so clever now, are we? At last I found a way to put the pressure on you, Mortimer. Look, just calm down, monsieur. You stopped me from ending it all. Uh, because oi. of you, I've had to pay for it. Uh, now look. I don't know what it's like. 
He's in your head. He's in your soul. I never want to feel that again. Jack, I did not betray you. You're just like him. Jack. Jack. Uh. Oh, you little shit. Uh. This one. Monsieur Pelu, I don't even know what this is all about. It's quite simple. You're like them. If that's enough to make me unforgivably evil, then I prefer you shoot. But I don't feel as if I've changed. I'm, I'm still the same man I was an hour ago. They will corrupt you. It's inevitable. I and I won't be able to resist like you are now. Uh, well. Give me the benefit of the doubt. Think about it a moment. So. What are you gonna do now? Oh god. You've just found out your true nature. What difference does it make? Well, not a lot. Um Fuck it. Jack, I can assure you that what Lord Mortimer just told me makes no difference. That's what you think. But you're already in his hands. And you don't even know it, Louis. No, Jack, it's the contrary. Everything that's been happening here has been carefully planned by the Golden Order for months. Mm -mm. And everything is going exactly as planned. No, it's Lower not. Your it's all right. It's over. You'll make it through. And you're going to get your life back. You're just like him. Uh, no. You are already. You can't see it, or you don't want to see it. But it's already too late. Jack. In fact, I haven't got any choice. Jack. You always have a choice. You know very well what will happen to you if you shoot me. Jack. Your daughter will grow up without a father, Jack. And you wouldn't like that when you send money to the orphanage that you sent her to to make sure she's safe, Jack. You're going to be held accountable. Yeah! You lose everything, starting with your freedom and then your head. I told you, I don't care. Not about yourself, maybe, but what about your daughter? It wouldn't be the same for her, would it? Shut up! Shut up! She will be alone in a world that you know is hostile. What will become of her? I... That's true, but... Don't abandon her. Not a second time. It's your last chance, my friend. Come on, Jack. Put it down. There we go. <laughs> it's over. Come down. <laughs> you know what I told you. Evil and good depend on you, and not on your nature. <laughs> yes, it's true, and the same holds true for all of us. Monsieur Peru, I am willing to overlook this lady. You can thank my son for that. I think, however, that you are to take your leave Yay. for your good and ours, as well as that of your daughter. Yeah. Jack's had a pretty shitty life, and then, like, he's basically been used by Mortimer really badly. So he's a bit, like, mentally, he's not in a great place. He's tried to kill himself previously, I think, and I had to talk him down. Um, so... I, I kind of wish that Jacques would just be allowed to leave the island, but they're not letting him leave. There were comments made about... Not too shaken up. You've experienced many significant events since your arrival. I, I'm all right. I don't really... Uh, I, don't, uh, I, I don't know if I'm all right, actually. To tell you the truth, I don't get much time to ask myself those questions. Quite right. Best not to react to all this too suddenly. Take some time to think about it all. For now, I think you ought to find Sarah, my son. You ought to talk things over with her. So she's been lying to me all along? Let her justify herself. What's done is done. Sarah must explain herself. You must clear the air. We'll have all the time we need to talk afterwards. But all in good time. B before you join her, I'd like to give you something. Is it As a new a hand? I would like to introduce you to your first talent. What do you mean? Open your mind, my son. Relax. You hold immense power. It's already there inside you. Empty your mind of all thoughts. Oh. Just let me show you the way. I should relax. Open your mind. Hear my voice. Feel the vibrations and listen to what has been happening to you deep inside. <laughs> But which you have been concealing. No, thank Trust you. Yourself. No. It's all already in there. No. I. I can hear something. Now breathe. It's a sound, very, very faint. That's right. Concentrate on it. My voice is growing fainter, but I am here. I. Whispers. I words. I don't like this. Mixed voices. Focus on one of them. Don't be afraid. I... 
I sense a stream. Some words are clear, but not all of them. Let them enter into your mind. I oh God! Hear them. Now, now I can hear a clear voice. Well done, Louis. Congratulations. What was it? You are now able to read people's minds. What? I. What? You heard me. From now on, whenever a human speaks to you, you will be able to read their current thoughts. So, if you need to know something in particular from someone, all you have to do is make them think about it. Brilliant. But that would be... <sighs> Fucking hell. Sorry, this is a bit of a, a bit of a information dump, isn't it? It's like, Jesus is my granddad. Jesus wrote the Book of the Dead slash Necronomicon. Uh, uh, we are half demon. Or actually, we might be full demon and Sarah is not our mum. <laughs> Uh, and now we could just read people's minds. I d uh, the fuck? Um, but that. I'd be violating their minds, wouldn't I? No, no, nothing of the sort. You yeah. won't really be penetrating their psyches. Let's just say you'll be picking up residual signals emitted by their thoughts. It isn't intrusive at all, rest assured. There are also a few rules you need to know that govern this talent when used between ourselves. You can Sorry? read the thoughts of demons as well as of humans. But be careful. Why? A demon what? more experienced than yourself will know that you are spying and will often react quite violently. All it's right. considered bad form to play around the psyche of another demon. Bad form? Of courtesy. Are you let's be clear. What is most considered bad form is getting caught. So is I would advise against trying to read the thoughts of Gregory. For Don't example. get caught. Home? Yes, the old grump is touchy and rather a stickler about the conventions. On that note, go and see Sarah, Louis. Otherwise, she might leave without you. We'll continue this discussion later if you want. All right. Just join me in my study when you've finished. Fuck my life. Holy shit. So we now have essence points. It looks like we've got separate essence points. You can earn one back when confronted to an immunity. Two, by exploiting a vulnerability. And three, by consuming a devil's thorn. Alright, okay. Fuck my life. This is just... It, this has gone wild. I mean, I knew it was going to go wildly off tangent where Mumsy went, there are demons in the world. But I didn't expect us to be doing mind reading. That's, uh... That's a thing. Mind reading related to Jesus, who apparently mind rapes people uh, to the point that they try and kill themselves. That's that's a fun, that's a fun direction. Uh, sure. Let's see what Mortimer is thinking about. He is thinking he might not have been clear enough with you <laughs> when I told you not to try to read into Gregory or her experienced demons. It also applied to me. Of course. <laughs> You, you you can hear me think? Of course I can. I can sense you. For the moment, your mind shines like a thousand lights because you haven't yet mastered the art of concealment from the psyches of others. So, when, when, oh. I give you a weapon, and the first thing you do is try to shoot me with it? If my intentions were evil, you would already be at my mercy. I was just so testing be it. be careful on whom you use the talent. All right, I apologize. I just literally do, and I thought I'd test it, you know? Like, you should at least have allowed me to do that, to go, oh, no, you've done that wrong, which is kind of what you've done, but I used to point up. All right. Please excuse me. And I... don't ever apologize, my son. Oh. You are far above that from now on. Oh, okay. Now go. One more thing. Go. If you want to know the truth about your birth, ask her about Paris, 1763. At 12 Rue des Martyrs. That's where she disembowled your mother to steal you from me. She killed my mother? She killed... Oh, hang on a minute. So she actually killed me mum. It's not that I regret all these discussions, but I must hurry to the war. Hurry to the wharf! Mother? 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 Just gonna run around going, Mumsy! But not Mumsy! Hello. 
Bish, where are you at? Oh, she's there, I think. Let's just check. There isn't anything to grab. Because sometimes there's stuff I've missed from previously. But no. No. Mumsy! Emily, what oh, are you doing not, here? You're not Mumsy. You wouldn't have seen... Mother? Mother? No! I saw that. You killed my mother! No, what's happened? No, Mother! No. Mother, she no! She ruined my life, Louis. <laughs> I am sorry. What were you thinking? Emma meant everything to me. Your mother destroyed everything by shooting her. I didn't... She uh. was me. And I was her. <sighs> but Sarah's not the one who killed Emma. Oh, shit. Uh... Uh... Well, I suppose if we do that, we can find out if she's a demon. Dear God, I beg you, make him kill me. Oh, I've had enough of it all. I no longer have the strength in me. Oh, lovely. Well, that was nice and cheerful, wasn't it? Uh, Raythonth, thank you for the 11 months in a row. Um, also, Lithia. Um, I hope the first child is going well. And I'm glad... I'm glad that I've helped with the bed rest and such. Shall I kill her? Shall I kill her? I mean, she wants it. But she... So, she's due any day now. Oh, my God. Get some curry down, you. Just start eating the spiciest curry you could find. That'll uh, just pop right out. Oh, God. Yeah, we can't... We shouldn't kill people. Like, we are... If, if we weren't a demon, we wouldn't be entertaining it. So... Um... I kind of want to stir the pot. I, wa I want to tell her Mortimer did it. Fuck it. You're the one who killed Emma, not my mother. And it wouldn't have oh. happened if Sarah had Shit. struck out at Emma first. Shit! I fucked that, didn't I? Whoops. Sorry, sorry. I thought that... I thought... Actually, no, Mortimer didn't kill her. What the fuck am I talking about? I keep assuming that uh, I keep mixing up Emma and uh, a young lady from the start. Uh, get her out of my sight. Yeah. Get out of here. Fuck off. I'm not going to kill her. Why have you always lied to me? Why didn't you ever tell me I was his son? Who knows? The thing is, we're not going to fall. Oh, no. I can't. Oh, success. I punched. I did not arrive in time to save Sarah Le Richer. I did not find out about Sarah Le Richer's lie. I did not stop Lady Hillsborough. This is probably because I spent too long finding out about my demon nature. Never mind. Um, I, I guess we'll just have to struggle through the next part <laughs> with no Mumsy. Mumsy is dead. Um... Fake mumsy. God damn it. This is what you get for asking too many questions. We could have saved her. We could have still have a full working hand as well. But never mind. It could have also been uh it could have been Peru. But it's fine. Like that's the thing. With this game, timing actually matters, whereas in a lot of choice driven narrative, uh it doesn't. And that's why I quite like it, even though sometimes the plot dumping is a bit like, what? Thirteen? Yes. That must be over... I can't... I still can't... Never com I still haven't completed that. That still number must be wrong. That still number. That doesn't make any fucking sense. You know what I mean. Um, we have four available points. I've actually gained a point in Conviction. Uh, so, I think, yeah, I think it's XP, actually, yeah, that might be right, it might be XP from objectives completed, not you've completed thousands of objectives, that would make more sense, 